Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, JC, and welcome back to my channel. We finally got a Black Ops 3 teaser. We need to chill out for a minute. I know everyone is freaking out. I could barely breathe after seeing that because I, I was already so hyped for the next game. And now with that coming so early this month, I, I'm just, oh my gosh, my mind has been blown. I, I almost broke my mic. I literally almost broke my mic running out the door telling my dad that. And I legitly did that. That was real, by the way. That was hilarious. But anyways... The thing I want to talk about in this video is the pine tree at the end of this teaser. Everyone's talking about the light rays at the beginning and how it possibly could show the Black Ops 3 logo on the ground. And since everyone's already talking about that, I don't want to talk about that. I want to talk about the pine tree at the very, very end because this stood out to me in this little teaser. And obviously, Treyarch wants us to figure out what this is and try to find any little clue we can in this teaser. And the thing that really stood out to me, like I said before, is the pine tree at the very end of it. I think it's a pine tree anyway. But it's out in a snowy field. It kind of looks like an Alaskan field somewhere. And it just so happens in the Black Ops 2 campaign, there was a mission where you had a flashback of Mason and his son David, of course, climbing a pine tree in the middle of Alaska. And they were just climbing it for fun, I guess. And David couldn't climb it. He couldn't do it. He was only like seven years old. And Mason was telling him to stop being a baby and climb it. And Mason, or not Mason, David got hurt. And then, I don't know, David was really upset in this flashback. But then at the very end of the game, and this is spoilers completely if you haven't played Black Ops 2, but at the very end of the game, when Mason is actually alive, when you saved Mason in the campaign, there's a secret way to save him. When you save Mason and he shows up at the very end of the game and sees his son again for the first time, they don't talk about how each other's been really. They literally talk about that one flashback. They talk about the pine tree where David was trying to climb it. They talk about how David fell from the tree and how Mason actually was proud of him for getting back up on his feet. He was proud of the courage that his son had to get back up and be a man, essentially. And I, I just thought it was very interesting that at the end of this teaser, we got something that resembles that tree. I don't know if that means anything. I don't know if that means that David is like really old in the next game, that this is far into the future and David is retelling uh, a story or a flashback of him and his dad climbing a tree and he has that little you know, picture of the tree in the t teaser. I don't know. And by the way, I honestly don't even think that's it at all. I just thought it was more of a cool little throwback, if anything. I don't I don't really think that the next game is Black Ops 3 at this moment. I, I really don't uh, think that at all. I think that's actually a new series. Uh, but I just think it's a nice throwback if it is a throwback and it's a nice resemblance to the Black Ops 1 and 2 story really and just the whole Mason concept like Mason and his son climbing that tree. That was just a very nice thing that happened to them in their lives and I think that's just a very cool thing if they meant to throw back to Black Ops 2. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think about it in the comments below. Honestly, I think this is just a hypnosis and someone's just watching a very nice video with, you know, wilderness stuff and trees and sunlight. And this is hypnotizing them, essentially brainwashing them. And I don't really think anything beyond that, really. I know I'm talking about David Mason and Mason himself climbing a tree, but I just think it's more of a resemblance once again. I don't think it actually... I don't think it's like a big story element, at least not right now. I don't want to like, I don't want to be one of those guys who just produces a theory off one single picture. I just, I just thought it was a cool thing if it was a throwback to that. Uh, but yeah, tell me in the comments below what you think. What does this whole teaser, what does this whole teaser mean? I have no idea. Like, I am so, so hyped. I can't even think straight. I know it sounds crazy. Like, I'm super excited like Team Martin, but really, I am really hyped up for the next Call of Duty. I mean, all I cover is is Call of Duty 2015 Zombies, and I just, I cannot absolutely wait. It's it's just insane, and I love how the video looks old-timey, too, so I don't know if that's a sign we're going into the past. I don't know if it's a sign that we're in the future, but we're using old-timey uh, stuff, kind of like Fallout. I have no idea, but I am hyped. So, again, tell me in the comments below what you think. This has been the third time I've said this, but this has been JC, and I will see you guys on the next video. That was amazing. Have a good one, guys.